what has to be factored into this is the broadcast as well. The play by play. Three. Wait, why? Why'd you go He's down? He's the worst. You don't like Eric Collins? No. Why? Everything is fine until he just goes, Miles Bridges! In the first quarter, just whenever there's a big dunk, he just screams. Big dunk, or even just like a big play, and like a clutch free throw. He's so entertaining. I love the energy. I, that surprises me that you don't like that because it feels like that's more of your realm. Yeah, like being like hyped and crazy about something. Oh no, you've probably never listened to me call a football game. Yeah, that's not well, how I don't you mean, call I don't football. mean while in a booth, but I mean in just in life oh, in general. Oh, and no. Yeah, there's like moments where you get hyped like that for sure, but I, I just am not all in on that one at all. Okay. I that's surprising me. I've never heard anyone say they don't like Eric Collins. His, like, call itself is fine. It just, like, if he did it, like, not every game, <laughs> whenever something happens, usually those moments are, like, the bang type of moments, like, in yeah. the corner. Like, that's when that should come out. Yeah. I just feel like it just happens a lot. I feel like just because there's a compilation video of him doing well, a bunch of this, like, I would say it's more like in the moments that Mike Breen would say bang, Eric Collins just loses his mind. <laughs> like, that's what's And Mike Breen yells bang too often. I just feel like once there's like a big moment, you used your peak and there's nowhere else to go. He does the double bang sometimes. I guess. And the biggest mo- he, like the biggest moments he has done the double bang. I feel like Mike Breen, there's not a better play-by-play guy. Like, oh, what, what was that face? Mike Breen's good. No, no, just interesting. Mike Breen is the GOAT. Man, I didn't know we felt this differently about... I think we just uh, have different uh, levels of like play. how you should call a game. Mike Breen is the pinnacle. He's of, vi- Okay. I just think he's like, he never makes mistakes even when he does it's like very like fast turned around like he's just so good his voice is so perfect for it his tone is like very consistent he's more even keeled like he's kind of the opposite end of the spectrum from eric collins but even with that even keeledness like when he gets like the bangs out there like it's, it's, it's just like, said he's the goat that is he, who is just, the goat kevin harlan are you insane you would say kevin harlan is undoubtedly unquestionably better Maybe than Mike just Green. basketball whatever but kevin harlan does baseball football and basketball at the highest level. I love Kevin Harlan. I'm not taking it away from Kevin Harlan. And I'm, I'm not, saying Mike Breen is like an at least equal candidate for being the GOAT. This is going to be a thing that we go round and round and round and round. It doesn't matter. But it's just, that's why. It's just the, without hesitation, how you just went, he's the GOAT. I'm like, what? Well, I mean, would you say that's weird to call LeBron the GOAT? If somebody was like, it's LeBron, it's the GOAT. Like, you wouldn't be like, oh, that's insane that you just With said LeBron's just the, the goat. basketball caveat for the announcer thing. I'm just saying, if you broke it down, I actually probably would lean Jordan. Like, in that, mm-hmm. if I had to actually pick one guy but i don't see any problem in just saying like lebron james he's like the goat there's very few guys that you can actually say that about he's one of probably only two guys that you can say that about just and I, feel, I feel like that way about mike breen all right well i guess we agree to disagree no eric collins never is lacking energy in a broadcast which is a thing that not everybody can do mm-hmm. i'm not saying he's bad by any stretch of the imagination i just think that like energy is a resource like moments so if you go to this extreme in the second quarter when the game is not close, what do you do when there's like this Ray Allen in the corner type of moment? Take his shirt off and break it. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like if a team was like mounting a comeback and like to tie the game up, there was a thunderous slam. That's when you lose your absolute mind as the home guy. Yeah. But he just does it like big dunks. It's never like, and the layup. He like doesn't do stuff like that. He might. It's a cool I think layup. He honestly has it. No, f- like I was not exaggerating when I said on a clutch free throw. Have you seen that clip of Terry Rogier hitting a free throw? And then like <laughs> Eric Collins' voice is just like oh yeah terry two beauties yeah that's wild anyway <laughs> different uh things for different folks different, different strokes, strokes for different folks, for different folks. Yeah. that applies just about everything in life